Hello, welcome to the channel and welcome back to Resurrect Autos HQ. So, guys, today we are, well, two things today. One, we're going to be continuing with the Fiesta, the one next to me. Um, we're going to be doing the timing belt, the water pump and all that sort of stuff. Uh, thermostat, thermostat housing, um, service. Yeah, everything that needs to be done mechanically on this car, we're going to do try and do today. But first... We've got a mechanical problem with the truck. So, I'll bring it in. I'll explain what's going on. Let's get into it. Let's do this. So, guys, I've got the truck in the workshop this morning first thing because we've got a little bit of an issue um, with this one. I need to get this done first thing, really, because it's, beginning, it's getting worse and worse and worse. So, basically... What's happening, I don't know if you can be able to hear this. <laughs> oh, God. Can you hear that? It's just. So basically what that noise is. Start a motor. So I went out and got this one uh, because the original one that's in there is completely, well, it's not completely at it because I've managed to start it, but it is very, very close to just giving up the ghost and failing completely. So I want to change that this morning because I can't <laughs> carry on the way it is. And then after I've done this, we're going to jump back on the Fiesta um, and continue with doing all the repairs and all the timing belt, the water pump, all those bits and pieces on this. So, yeah, let's get set up. Let's do the truck first, and then we'll move on. Let's do this. That, guys, was an absolute nightmare. <laughs> I've got to be honest, because there's just no room, absolutely no room to get that, to get to the bolts to undo it. It is crazy. Um, but I managed to get it done. But it did take, it took me quite a long time to undo two bolts, which is it's just mad. It's just unbelievable. But um, yeah, anyway, got it off, <laughs> going to swap it over for the other one I got, um, and then we'll go from there. Didn't go for a new one in the end, um, they like double the price of um, um, one from the breakers, so just going to swap this one over, uh, but it's a lot easier 
to, to get you know take the wheel off and go through this little this little flap there's a little flap here that goes like that oops there goes the torch um <clears throat> so yeah they they do try you know Mitsubishi have tried to make it a little bit easier so you've got access to go to to get certain things done like this one there's another flap there you know and there's obviously things in there that you can get to so they are trying to make it <laughs> accessible uh, but that is the only sort of really, really the only. This is position here is the only really way to get it through. Uh, possibly be able to move a few of these lines and stuff like that. But I thought, you know, let's just see if I can get it done without moving those kind of bits. And yeah, it did take a bit of time, but um, managed to get it removed in the end. Right. So now I'm going to put this one in, um, get it all back together, and then we can jump on. Oh, we can jump on um, and, and continue with the Fiesta, but I just need to get this truck done first. So let's set up. Let's do this. Do you know what, guys? I'm absolutely shattered already. <laughs> just, just to, to change that starter motor. It's all back together. So let's see. I've not tried this. Let's see if this is going to be, yeah, any good. Oh. So much better. There we go. Right, that is solved. Let me get the truck out of the way, and then I'm going to set you up, Get jump straight onto the Fiesta. We're going to start doing uh, the timing belt, the water pump, and all that sort of stuff. So bear with me for the moment, and I'm going to set you up over there. Let's do this.
Right, guys, making some great progress now. Um, as you can see, all stripped out, water pump, timing belt, all been removed. Um, the actual timing belt is the original one. So, yeah. Formico. So that's the original belt from new. Um, but I've got to be honest, it ain't in that that bad condition is it's starting to crack a little bit and it's starting to it's starting to age you can see the lines but i've seen much much worse um on newer cars i can't see as if that's going to be changed by Ford. i really can't see it i don't think they supply them now i think that it's only from new um I think it says Daco when they, when when Ford's change them. I'm not quite sure actually, but I can't see if I think I think that's the original one. Anyway, that's gone. Water pump. Um, so we're gonna change that as well. Um, all in the kit. So Daco. I am looking at cars today, as well, guys. So I'm just seeing what the auction's gonna be like. I'm not gonna show you what I'm actually looking at, but um that'll be a surprise if I if I if I win another project from an that's actually from another auction place um from when I won it before. I'm always looking, you know that. Um it's just buying them at the right price. We'll see. Um but let's continue now um to do the reverse. So uh new water pump, new timing belt, new tensioner, um all back together, box it all up, and then just continue. So that is what I'm gonna do now. So let's do this. You know what guys that didn't take long at all um one minute i was i had loads of bits and pieces everywhere the next minute it's more or less put back together still got a few bits like the throttle body's got to go back on there uh the air box i'm not gonna put the air box in until we've swapped over the, the air fuel so i'll do that as well uh auxiliary, new auxiliary belts got to go in there connect that back up a few pipes be connected so a few bits and pieces but we're definitely definitely getting there it's looking um it's looking like it's an engine bay again, <laughs> unlike before. So we're definitely getting there, guys. Uh, this is the old one. Um, a lot of people were saying on the comments, well, why don't you just replace the rubber that's there? There, can you see that rubber? 
So what happens is, over time, where the bolts go through, you can see there's four in each corner. Where these bolts go through, they the, the plastic part shrinks against the metal part, um, and that don't and then you can't get an actual a proper a secure um, uh, fix in there. Plus that that rubber is it is part of it, but I always I can't trust them really. I never trust these old um, plastic um, thermostat housing. So I always change for a new thermostat, new thermostat housing, and then that's it. I know I'm covered. So yeah, good news about the cars. Uh, that I was looking on, on the Copart today. I did manage to win one, but it's still on approval. So we'll wait to see what they say about that. Will they let me have it or not? That's just something we we'll have to wait and see again. Uh, more games with uh, the insurance companies, but it is what it is. So let's crack on, guys. Let's get set up, continue putting all this back together, and then I want to turn that key. I haven't dropped the oil yet. Or the oil filter until I know that it's okay when it comes to running and then after that we'll get it up to temperature um, and then we'll drop the oil do the oil filter oil change um, and go from there but let's let's carry on let's just see how far we can get let's do this Right, so guys, there we go. She's all back together, apart from this headlight, which was already removed because of the wing. But everything else is all been put back on. Um, yeah, I'm always checking, you know what I mean? Because sometimes you just leave out a plug or you leave out a wire or something like that. So I'm just, just checking, checking, checking to make sure that it's all there. I think we're we're ready. So let's go for startup i think um i haven't done this yet so i don't even know if this is gonna go let's see if she'll go oh. right ready lovely I don't want the air comes on I just want to turn that air condition off.
That fan should go off in a second. There we go. There we go. Absolutely lovely, spot on. No misfires, because I can, I can see it and hear it. So that, that's good. Right, okay. That's good. That is good news. Right, I'm gonna leave it there because I wanna I've got to shoot off early today. I've got to do a school run. <laughs> so I've got to, yeah, got to shoot off early today. So I'm gonna leave it there. That's gonna be the end of today's video. But good news, it's all back together and she starts with no issues or problems. Um we're gonna resume this tomorrow, we'll come back tomorrow, finish it all off. Um, put the wing on, put the headlight in, do the service, clean it up a little bit more than what it is already. Um, I don't know if I want to get an MOT done tomorrow. I'll try and book one in for this. If not, um, yeah, we'll have to come back. Um, we'll have to come back to it and do it another day. But but so far, so good, guys. It's going to back really well. Done absolute loads today on this one but like i said i've got to finish early so i'm going to leave it there that's going to be the end of today's video thanks for watching guys don't forget to drop me a comment give the video a thumbs up and i'll see you tomorrow in the next one take care see you soon